Bloodbath, Massacre, Killer, Dead. Those are all understatements, everybody. Welcome back, Kronos fam. MMF, 31 cents and going lower to 30 cents. Completely crashed. People panicking for sure. Checking some of the comments online. Tectonic, 6 liters 4, Versa, everything. Crap. It's just so bad right now. The prices are so bad, so low, so down, so bloody. This is a definition that I always like to refer as crypto goes higher than, than our expectations and lower than our expectations. And this is exactly the bloody red market that some of us kind of like anticipated for some bearish type of markets. But of course, we're not blind as to what happens in the last 24 hours, 48 hours with crypto.com reducing, capping and taking away all those rewards from the card users. It's having ramifications everywhere, right? Massive waves going through and breaking the entire Kronos ecosystem. Prices, once again, price related, 26 cents crow. 26 cents crow right now. Bitcoin shaking, but not by, by a lot. Kronos, crow coin is really, really down. 31 cents right now. We, we go right here, less than 1 billion, less than 1 billion. Effective as of right now of this video. I'm refreshing now to see the latest number. Everybody, welcome back. My name is Oscar Ramos, 958. So definitely, everybody, not really the greatest news. And well, we are here no matter what good news, bad news, worst news, or best news. We're here. And first and foremost, what am I doing? Am I selling? My, am I leaving? Am I just panicking or so? It's just this reaction of, man, we're super bad when it comes to the price once again. Taking a look at the project, they've been putting Hakuna Matata, right? Um, the importance of the project and of the Savannah Finance, M MUSD, the ecosystem that MMF is trying to build. And there was a message that they were trying to road ahead. And I read it. It was basically what I liked, you know, something that is portraying to become an ecosystem for stablecoin, NFT, GL Optimizer, AMM, DEX. And the road ahead is big and huge. But take a look at this right now. Kronos, Apecoin, of course, down, everything down. Oh, officially, as of right now, just looked at it. There it is. And I talked about it. If you, if you just watched a couple of my videos ago, we're now position 21, lower than Litecoin, everything crashing. Okay, 1.72 and probably heading to the 1.60. Let me go ahead and refresh this. 1.71, we're going to get to 160 trillion, no question about it. We come here. So it's just as we're going through it, we're going through it. It's happening quick, quick, quick. We're dropping massively. I mean, right now, the one that I used to do is not even showing here. I'm going to refresh this. Probably it's going to say it right here. Uh, will it say it right now? But I, I'm, I was doing it from 2000 APY down to 400 APY that I saw just a couple of minutes ago. It's not showing for some reason. But the wrap crow on MMO, it's actually going higher, which I really, really like and I appreciate from them. Here it is, 441, 1700 wrap, like it. So I'm not leaving. It is already too late for anyone if you are investing in, in MMF. It is already too late to sell for profits if you bought a couple, I mean, April. Just April, let alone April, right? When everything was really nice. March was skyrocketing like a non-stoppable force wave. Right now, crashing really nice. Take a look at the price. Going back to the very beginning. We're time travelers. Time travelers. Massive drop of about 85%. Um, okay, so what's the deal? What do we do now? I'm not selling. I'm not leaving. I have some money, some few monies that I have allocated for crypto. I'm doing day trading with a uh, Kronos, but Tonic is at a price that is stupid, uh, stupidly low. Like what an amazing price. VVS Finance. Now, Oscar Ramos, you've been saying this for a while, but yeah, right. But um, just what a great price is. Now, I, I, you go to these different places, right? You still can earn some decent amount, much higher than what you're going to get in 
the card, right? And in DeFi, even uh, when it comes to the twelve percent on on on, on Crocoin, and of course, way more than the earn on the you know easy app on the blue app. But this is just the best we got. It's the best we got. It's tough. The prices are liquidating so fast. Nine fifty eight right now. Million less than one billion. But guess what, everybody? Once again, right, we have to remind everyone here that uh, this shall pass. These are the type of liquidations that come at the worst time possible when we are aspiring to be, man, approaching an all time, an altcoin season, probably in 2022. Here's the realization that crypto is, is very volatile and it's risky and you have to buy what you can afford losing. Always remember that I've been saying that for a long time. And you're getting my exact reaction right here, completely transparent, completely transparent. I'm not selling anything, nothing my, of my Bursa, nothing of my Tonic, nothing of my, of my, of my MMF, nothing of my MMO, and nothing of my BVS Finance. Savannah, Matt getting crushed right now, negative 48%, negative 45%. MMF is getting crushed to, ooh, 29 cent. Ooh. Man. Really great and liquidated right now. From what I know, it's all this reaction and panic selling. It's just a lot of panic selling, right? Panic selling or because it just makes no sense. Like it's a good project. Why will people sell? Well, now because it's open on the application right now, a lot of people can liquidate if they want as they own stake. But it is weird. Like, there's a lot of MMF I know staked, but the price crashing. It is what it is, everybody. Um, not leaving. Definitely a big punch in the gut for everything. If I refresh this, are we already at 1.6. Then we're going to be heading there. And crypto.com, 26 cents and going lower. Well, <sighs> My plan right now, I'm 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 unstaking my crow, eight thousand plus crow that I had there, and the plan is of course to send it to MMF to earn some more percentages. At this point, nothing makes sense when it comes to the price. Uh, it's just about holding. I have to hold. There's no other way to do so. I cannot sell. I'm I'm gonna take a huge loss. Um, some people are selling because they're probably just leaving Chronos because they don't like they don't like it anymore. I actually went to Twitter and I tweeted to Chris to maybe invite him for a live. Just trying to do so people can have transparency and, and um, communication, right? So maybe I think that's really important for beginners, advanced people who want to hear from the people at the top of chain of command. So that's what I'm doing. MMF crashing badly. There's no other way to put it. 26 heading to 25 cents. I'm um, sorry. No, I'm, I'm looking at Kronos. <laughs> Here it is. At a uh, 26, 28 cents, so really, really bad. But um, hey, you know, wanted a great time to get into Chronos ecosystem. Here it is. I haven't checked DeFi Llama, but with all of this, we're already number 10 or 11. Already 10 or 11. Have to be. No longer position 7, no longer position 8, no longer position 9, position 10 or 11. Tough day, everybody. But at the same time, if you know what you're doing, if you are looking at the projects, not only the price, in my opinion, I see it's a great time for us to get in, in my opinion, with some positions, move forward, and it's going to be fine. Thank you for watching, everybody. Tough day for Kronos holders starting May as a tough month so far with just barely two days. Peace.